Okay, folks, so now we, down, we, we put everything together in the box. We, we, we started the computer and it's saying that uh, <coughs> overclock fail, please end the setup. Well, maybe because I was messing with it a couple of days ago and I was trying to, and I was overclocking it. And when my son came back, I took it all apart again so he could put it together himself. So maybe that's why. But we're going to find out. Uh, and hit F1 and, and run the setup. We hit F1 and we're, we're running the setup here. And, we, and he's going to find out how to, how, how to flash this. You see it's showing that you have, before we load the system in here, we got to make sure that it's showing our SATA drive and our DVD drive, optical drive because the optical drives was going to load up all the programs onto the hard drive so we got to make sure that that's the first booty boot device so we're going to go to boot boot priority CD-ROM first boot device, second boot device, a SATA Samsung HD, that's good and that's all we need we know that that's set we could load our system and it's going to accept it because it's reading it. Now, let's go back to this overclocking business. Jump for free configuration. Overclock profile. We are 20%. I don't like this motherboard. It's crappy. This is Aces. The Aces are overrated. I, I, I like the uh, voice stuff. The 40 with the 41 chipset, which it's a cheaper motherboard, and uh, by price I paid 45 dollars for it, including shipping shipping from 3B Tech, and I bought the Aces like for 55 dollars, including shipping. But the Aces, I don't know, it's kind. Of, it, 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 I find the voice to be a little quicker, to be a little a little more spunk to it. This one, I don't know. I'm not too happy with it. So we're going to hit it on 15% overclock. We want 20%. This chip has an 8 by multiplier. The E47 has a, a 13 multiplier and it's running on a 60, 60 nanometer. This is a 40 nanometer chip. I don't know. I don't know about these for some of these 40 nanos because they, 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 they control the overclocking too much. The older chips have a larger multiplier and you can overclock more. You press 10 and enter which is which is safe. Safe to the CMOS. <coughs> See, she boots up kind of slow compared to the other one. See, it's starting Windows. Windows was already in there. So it doesn't take the 20% overclocking. I'm, I'm going to mess with it because this chip will go up higher than that. This chip will go up 